Hello there, YouTube channel. Just wanted to give an update today on the 2023 Home Lab server rack that I currently have set up. Just wanted to do a couple edits from the previous video and provide a little bit more clarity and such. Um, so a couple things I was mentioning is that I do run Pi-hole with recursive DNS uh, on my system and I also run Kuma Uptime which will ping my various devices but I didn't show the device that does that. So I actually have a Raspberry Pi and you'll see him right there. Um, it's got a 64 gig um, SD card in there but I run Pi Hole and I run Kuma Uptime um, on there as well. So I forgot to point out he's very handy. Uh, I just replaced it recently with a newer one but I've never had issues with it. Um, it does what it needs to do and I've got you know my gravity uh, lists and everything set up on there which I'll show in a different video once I show the actual applications but I wanted to show that Raspberry Pi that I have set up there as well and then for my access points I didn't point that out I do have ubiquity access points I've actually got three in the house I've got a U6 a U6 Pro and then I've got one of those um, uh, beta ones that uh, ubiquity was running on their website before they turned that down um, I, they're all running, I think, 4x2 MIMO and 4x4 MIMO. So I have three of these, one downstairs and then two upstairs. So I wanted to point those two things out. Also coming back down here, I wanted to make clarification on my RPS that was not running through my 10 gig aggregation switch because that's just obviously a 1 gig on there. So I wanted to point those out as well. A couple changes I made as well. My, my cloud is actually running my Plex right now. Um, it's got 24 terabytes right now. Um, it's got the application built in. I may switch it over to a different machine because I want to keep that for backups. But that's running Plex right now. I am experimenting with Proxmox. And that is going to be on my R340 down there. So I'm going to be running Proxmox. Right now I'm running pretty much Hyper-V as my primary right now. Um, which is on my... Uh, R340 or T340 on the back there but that's got a heck of a lot more storage than my other one so just wanted to point that out right now uh, for those changes again I'll be doing videos weekly uh, to give you all updates and then we'll go into uh, Unify and talk about the various uh, uh, firewall rules and, and how I've got my VLANs and everything set up alright you guys have a great weekend